In this unit, we're going to talk about what you have to do in Project Zero, and actually, you don't have to do much. Project Zero consists of two tasks. First of all, you have to download the Nanto Tetris software suite and put it on your computer. This will take you something like two or three minutes. And then you have to submit uh, an HDL program through the Coursera website just to make sure that you know how to, uh, how to use the user interface and so on. That's it. So, let us talk about downloading the software. In order to do it, you go to the Nanto Tetris uh, website and you click software. This page will open up and within this page you have to focus on uh, this link. You click it and a Nanto Tetris uh, zip file is going to be downloaded to your computer. You take this zip file, you extract it somewhere in your computer. We recommend that you do it in your desktop and uh, that's it you're going to have a folder called NAN to Tetris. Let us take a look at this folder and see what's inside. Well, basically this folder has two subfolders. One of them is called Tools and the other one is called Projects. <clears throat> In the Tools folder, you will find a whole set of uh, software tools that we are going to use both in this course and in the second course, which is not yet offered. So basically, we're going to use the first three tools, Hardware Simulator, CPU Emulator and Assembler in this course, and the remaining tools will be used in Nanto Tetris Part 2. If you look at the project subfolder, you will find 13 projects in it, or 14 projects actually, including this one, uh, Project Zero. And once again, these projects are going to be split into two categories, and you can by and large ignore completely the second category. So, once again, we're going to talk about a subset of all these uh, resources and projects, and that's what we're going to focus on in, uh, in part one. We decided to you know, go ahead and give you everything for those of you who want to continue to do the second part of the course on their own, but once again, please ignore everything uh, which is not mentioned in this slide. So if you open this folder called 000, which is associated with Project Zero, you will find in it a single file named file.txt. And all you have to do in Project Zero is submit this file through the Coursera course uh, website. And we want you to do it because we want to make sure that you know how to upload the file and we want to make sure that we received it so that you will be ready to submit homework later on in the course. So, first of all, make sure that you've downloaded the course software suite to your computer and that you can access uh, uh, this file through the um, uh, course structure, the Nanto Tetris uh, uh, two folders. And once again, take this file, submit it, and you are done with Project Zero. So that's the end of this unit. And moving along to uh, the next unit, Unit 1, let's build a computer.